Let me see what my friend Lou is sending me here. Today, <laughs> James, Louis changed the name on the Skype every day. Today is Vance got raped this month. Unbelievable, Louis. Okay, let me take the notes right here. Okay, okay, recording on. Okay, guys, we're gonna start the forum. We're gonna, I'm gonna explain first uh, the euro dollar, and then we're gonna go over the rest. Uh, the euro dollar, I mean, eventually, is an import from the from the top, and the subdivision that the wave that we like is something like this, something like this, or you can see it like this, or you can see it like this with an extended wave phi. Do not matter. I believe that wave three, I believe that wave three ended at the low with a 90% accuracy. I believe that that's where we are. And then the reason that I like that, I'm gonna to explain to you guys why. First, this is the lowest read on the Teddy Mino RSI. That's the lowest read on the RSI right there. And second, I didn't get this move from here. It looks completed with a secondary RSI divergency. So that's telling me that in my view, you have to see if you want to get into the insides, when one, two, three, four, when the three should divide it like one, two, three, right here, four, and then extend the five that went like one, two, one, two, three, four, four, three, four, and five. So you can count nice swing from here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. This is a move from here completed so and then this is a move that started here also completed so if you go outgrade the RSI now in an hour you can see that you don't have divergency so that's telling you that you are in a wave three that ended here with the subdivision that I'm showing you and 90% sure that that's the correct count. I don't know if you guys have any idea. So now comes the proposal wave five. And like James, like we always say, like we always say, they won't be easy. And now you have to take the shot at 3741 or even 38. 27 against eventually the risk is too high you gotta get entered against 90 38 96 to get another low now i would say seeing the channel between one and three right here i would i know for sure that 37 41 they should be seller right here they should be selling right there. And you got to take a shot right there to the short side, in my opinion. And then if you go and you put the euro in a four hour, I mean, I was telling James, we were talking over, over an hour and a half this morning. And one of the things that we were saying is that unless it was 2008, we haven't seen anything like this. 
This is unbelievable. This is 2008 right there. That's 2008. This market went in three weeks. It went over 1,100 picks and add, it dropped 600 picks in less than three days. That's unbelievable. Move like that happens in 2008. Now, this is the four hour. You guys can see the count there. One, two, and then the other way that you can call it is one, two, one, two, three, four, five. You can see the seven swings. So it needs one more swing lower to complete a five-way swing, in my opinion. We adjust this a little bit. And to be honest with you guys, I was looking at to the right to make it happen without forcing a buyers or forcing a count to make it happen like it did A, B, C, W, S, A, B, C, W, S, A, B, C, like a triple success, something like that. But in, in, in other words, guys, this do not matter which way you're laboring right now, because technically that's a three-way move to the top. Now, somebody asked me today which was the only alternative to the outside. It's only one, guys. At this stage, there's only one. That the euro is going to make an S wave. I don't want to get there. And as a, as, as you know, guys, how many times we repeat it on Sunday. That out of the weekly counts that we present on Sunday, we say like 70 times, seven times that we were operating on the discount. We were showing the other two, but we were operating on the discount. Now, the question is, is, do, is this all we're going to get in the e-way needs to be seen? But well, that's the only alternative that this is S way down that needs to get in three, but do no matter what it is, I want you guys to understand. One more time, getting back to the four hour. No, no, no. My opinion, you got to be aggressive. You got to go with the dollar. That's my opinion as a personal opinion. And that's how early away forecast me and James decided to go. You need to go with the dollar. If no, you're going to. I remember and. James knows that, and I know it too. I know, I know many of you guys also maybe were trading on 2008, but, but, a move like this, when you don't even know about it, the euro is at 125. For personal opinion. Now, it's going to happen, Rafi. That's, that's, the, that's the point, yeah, that's the point that I'm going to make. That's why I get back here, guys. You need to think smart, and that's something that me and James also, we were talking today, because James is almost ready, James is almost ready with his farm, and we were talking about it, that, exactly, I, we were talking about it. Like this, Rafi. You have to go and let's take this as experience. Do you guys remember the euro? Right? The euro was very clear until here. Remember, guys? Very clear. What we were spreading on the euro, three ways back, right? To 135 at the moment. It didn't win that low. Now, the message is this. There is the idea that it already broke below, below this level. It takes away any continuation of this move. Like a flat, whatever. Any continuation of that move. Now, 
Elio weighs wide. He needs two. The only bullish buyers or bullish scenario is that he makes another low, he makes a three backs, and he makes another five. Guys, follow me. That's the only bullish scenario you guys can see, and then going from here. I said right now, there is seven ways right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, a new low is going to make a corrective pullback without question right there. Now, what you guys should do is sell every three ways. Because right here, right here, you can see one, two, three. It's like you buying here. Now, why do I say that? Because there is no guarantee in this world that it's going to get to the 50 or the 618. It can get to the 76.4. But you know how you cash this move when the market goes one way? You have to be aggressive. Now, after nine ways, all you have to do is you got to go and you're going to enter in a small piece at the 23.6, at the 3802, at the 50. You have to subdivide your, your account in five entries. And you gotta take the you gotta take the hit. I did that in a phone account on 2008 and 2010, 2008, and that's the only way that you can catch the move. Otherwise, otherwise you're gonna yeah most likely otherwise that most likely as i yes most likely because otherwise exactly because otherwise you can you can miss the move now let me show you let me see if i can go back in time and and explain to you guys what i'm trying to say because remember like we've been saying Man, look, that's as powerful. You, that's the eight-hour chart. You cannot. You have to go to the daily to see what I mean. Let me go to my daily charts right here. One second. But I want you guys to understand. You have to go with the dollar. Don't think otherwise. You have to go to the dollar. I mean, that's what we say on Sunday. That. We were favoring the the the, the, bu the bullish dollar because of the cable. <laughs> now, right here is the daily. If you get back, the worst can happen. So the new guys understand what we mean. The worst can happen. James, you remember that we got this move, Louis. You remember we all got it. We got all this complete move right here. When the euro bounced and we thought, uh, we got this move because this is, the, this is the perfect example of what's happening right now. Look, when you see that, you need to attack. Because look, if you take right here, the retracement, 3802. That's it. Remember, James, that we got that one? I got that one. Everyone, James, Louis, and myself, we all got that one at that moment. Send right here, look. A move like that, 3802. 3802. That's the worst can happen. Look, 3802. Always 3802. When the euro, is, euro goes strong like that, never is going to give you 618. Never. And then unless, look, this is 2009, 2008, 2010, look, 30A02. And I remember that I landed the wrong way. I remember, and James also, I remember 
because I got it, my friend. I got it almost, and I know James got it too. I got all this level, all this move I got it. I make almost $200,000 in this month. And you know what I got it, right? Because every one of us, we will cash in the top right here. And guess what? This was a non fine peril. Nobody has what it takes to fade this move because everyone was expecting another high. I remember like it was today. This was Thanksgiving 2009, Dubai War. Remember, James? Boom. I remember me having sent Thanksgiving 9, and I see that thing drop it. I say, cannot believe it. Remember, and then right here we were spreading a new high, like an ending diagonal. One, two, three, four, five. I remember like it was today. And then that thing dropped on Friday. And I remember this level 46, 20, the low in Dubai, like it was today. When I saw that low broke and say, I cannot believe I'm going to miss this move. And then, I remember the suit division here, and I say, okay, it's going to back. Never. I can show you this, uh, Hazard. Everything is 38 or 2. Look, 38 or 2. 38 or 2. That's it. That's all you got. Yeah, 38 or 2. And I remember this one. As I had, of course, I have a $1 million account in that moment. And I say, you ain't going to beat me, my friend. I'm going to get you out. And I, and I do that. I went over here, and I trace my feeble, and I say, I'm going to start selling in suit division, like 23.6, 38 or 2, 50. And I do my, my margin projection right there, and I say, okay, now you got me. And that's how you cash them all. Otherwise, you're gonna be you're gonna be an observer. That's how it is. Look, same right here, and this is the worst can happen right here. A three-way move like he did right here. That's the worst, but it's gonna be a continuation to the downside, and you're gonna be ready. You gotta cash it. Otherwise, you're gonna get it. And we know in any way when to push the pedal. And we know when to be more aggressive. Now, look, I know the 38 or two. Because you know what? Machines, they're very smart. And they know that people love the euro. And they turn around on the 38 or two. They knew right here that everyone was expecting 30, uh, 35, 50 area. 38 or two. That's all they do when they go in trend. Now, this is another, this is powerful, guys. Look, right here, another sample. 38 or 2, 23.6. That's all they're going to do. I know. You have to, if, let's say, that's a good question, Azar. You are a very, very good trader. I told you yesterday. Look, look, if he makes a low and he goes here, this is my personal recommendation, and we're going to trade that. We're going to trade that. This is my personal recommendation, guys. You cannot deny what can happen. And what can happen is that this move can take the euro lower. If the triangle, daily triangle is in place, this is a trust for the triangle. And I see the S&P, and at least the euro can give you the ocean or the, or the double zigzag. The dollar S&P is bearish. S&P is bearish, guys. I can tell you that. Now, if that's the case, my friend, let's say, let's make, let's make, yeah, but you got to be smart. Let's say, 
that right here, you enter a 37.96. Let's make that number, right? With a 35.18 low, which is the, the, this, this high right here. Anybody have issue with the audio? No, James, it's your shoe. One second, let me reset.